guys and welcome back. You are at home with Cardi Garford. I've got a bit of an improv one for you tonight because I wasn't even planning on doing any filming here but it's such a beautiful day and I've just come outside and uh, the wife's cut the grass and moved a few things around in the garden as you may or may not notice. All of a sudden the kids football goal is right in the middle of the park there and I could not resist hitting golf balls into it so I thought you know what I'm going to film it. I'm going to try and also turn it into something half instructional. Alright, so what I'm going to do, those that have watched my channel before all this madness will remember me talking about um, using uh, different clubs to what you'd normally use in different situations etc etc and the appreciation of uh, learning how to manufacture shots and work a, work a ball this way or that or, or doing different things with different clubs with different balls etc etc and I always liken it to Cedric Ballesteros and how he learnt with only one club is free iron that's why I did the one club challenge, that's why I did the trying to make a birdie with only a one iron. All right, so this is linked, but this is something you can do in your garden. Get yourself a target. Doesn't have to be a football goal. It could be, it could be two cones, it could be two jumpers for goal posts, whatever you want to do. And you just try and hit it into there with every club you've got in your bag. I'm starting low with my log wedge because that's the club I've been using all week. Should be, uh, bread and butter for me now. Apparently not. Can't move on until you've done it with every club. Oh yes we're in. Through the side netting but it's gone in. That's the inside of the side netting. there with 52. Oh, come on. oh no! Yes, we're it. Also being super careful again not to take divots. That should shut out my action. Oh, straight in with the pitching wedge. For some it will get harder and for some it will get easier as the club starts to get longer. Oh, that's not a good miss. That's not a good shot. Come on, 9 iron. Nah. Got to be more aggressive. Can't trust the bounce. Yes. Yeah, it's another one, genuinely, is so much harder than it looks this. That thing to win. I should add, I've actually left my seven iron at work, so I can't do a seven. I'm going to skip seven, go straight to six. Also just grows technique, stuff like this, shots you wouldn't necessarily think to hit. You start to learn about how the ball flight reacts and stuff like that, just for when you need it. There's my alignment, just everything's right. Better. Into a four iron. Resisting the temptation not to just swing it is just so hard as well. Peppering the right hand side of the garden. Plastic over compensation. There we go. Three iron. Not everyone carries three, uh, four irons. I'm even going to do it my two iron in a minute. Just go up through the bag with whatever you've got.
toast. It's great seeing Bob Corner. <clears throat> Classic driver off the deck. Probably the least relevant. I can't really foresee a circumstance where Why not? There you go, guys. So another fun little challenge. Get out there. Find yourself becoming more inventive. Create a new little skill for yourself, a new little string for your bow, being able to create different shots with different clubs because you never know when it's going to come in handy. Enjoy doing it. Let me know how it goes. Let me know what you think. Stay safe. See you tomorrow.